Hey guys, this is Great Tech with another Scratch tutorial. Today we're going to be learning how to make a game, I mean not really a game, a quiz on Scratch. And today's topic is going to be on math. So we're just going to be uh, asking questions on math and if you get it right, you get one point. If you get it wrong, you get no points. And we're going to connect um, the information that we get using cloud data so that we could have high scores and that sort of stuff. Let's get started. So first we're going to start with an event. When flag is clicked, we would want to ask a question. So when flag is clicked, ask um what is 92 plus 7? We're just gonna make simple questions. When you guys do it, your questions will be different and they don't have to be on math. It could be about anything. And then we're gonna make a new variable called Q1, which means question 1. So we're gonna set, and we're not gonna show this. So what is 9? Um, 92 plus 7 so we're gonna set question 1 to the answer so whatever you write will be set to a variable called q1 and if the variable is equal to 92 plus 7 so the answer the real answer first we're gonna have to find out what 92 plus 7 is 92 plus 7 is 99 so so now we got the answer the real answer so if q1 is equal to 99 we're going to we're actually not going to use an if I have a better idea it's going to save more time we're going to use an if else so if the answer is 99 we're gonna make a new variable total score just click it twice and put it right there so if it's 99 then we're gonna change score by one if it's not 99 so else we're gonna change the score by negative one if you get 5, you win. That's like the max you could get. So like the high score would be 5. And if you want to set a high score, you obviously need 5. Many people could have the same high score. So now we could get started with the second question. I'm just going to click duplicate. So everything... Like, you know, get copy pasted, that sort of thing. So, the second question would be if x is equal to 1, solve x plus 1 is equal to 2. You see a simple question like that. x is obviously 1, but we need a new variable called question 2 not gonna show that we're just gonna change everything set question 2 to the new answer and we're gonna change total score by 1 total score by minus 1 let's test this out now in the testing stage so what is 92 plus 7 if I get 99 uh I'm actually gonna change I'm actually gonna change something because the variable you can't see your score. And I don't like that, so we're gonna click flag, what's ninety two plus seven? And then and when I click enter this should be one. If that turns into one, we know that our script is correct. So let's see enter one. And if x is equal to 1, so if x plus 1 is equal to 2, the answer is 1. So the total score right here should be 2. 2. 
So that was pretty much a simple quiz like that. If you would like cloud data to see who got the highest score, or actually who got two points, because this game is out of two, so if you got two points, you want to be on the list of people who got two points. So high score, so everyone could pretty much get in high score, or we could actually make a list. But I prefer using high score. Oh, I actually changed my mind, and we're using a list. So I just made a simple list called. I don't know what I call it, ASD, and I'm gonna make that, that size. So, all your scores get sent into this chart. So, we're gonna add thing, but then we're gonna use uh, join hello world. So, add the username, username, and then that zoom I mean we're gonna add another join hello world I'm just gonna add a colon some space for the high score no it's total score to be entered and now we're gonna share this so let's test it out so what's 92 plus 99 let's solve x plus 1 is equal to 2 1 so, as you can see, I got 4, mass squared, 7, 8, 6, 4. I get put on the list, but I'm not supposed to be getting 4. We forgot to add, when flag is clicked, set high score to 0. Total score. Well, when flag is clicked, we want everything to be set to 0. Right now, it's not set to zero, it's set to something else. So, when we do that, we're now gonna click flag 92 plus 7. As wait, um, before we solve this, as you can see, um, this list is pretty much like cloud data, which could be found like right here if we had cloud data, but in this list, it's pretty much cloud data in a table. And it's on your screen. That's why I prefer it as I think this is more organized than cloud data. So 92 plus 7. First, let's say I get this wrong. What if I say a number like that? And by the way, if you get a number like that, you should actually um, get help. So if x is equal to 1, x plus 1, so we're going to say 1. And my score is zero, so my score right here is zero. And now we're gonna go through some table scripting. As you can see right here, this is four. And we wanna remove the four. You see that X right there? You could click that. Or we could use the script right here. Delete one of ASD. And I'll click flag after everything is solved let's go and delete the first one of ASC thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time please like subscribe comment and make sure to check out the website createtech.ca bye